welcome to our channel once again guys and today I'm excited to bring you this recipe and that's no other than cassava roti how many of you remember that so cassava roti was being made in Guyana long 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 ago and today we're gonna bring you that recipe guys we're gonna bring you back to the old days and for that we don't need a lot of ingredients we need some flour cassava of course and some baking powder and that's it with some water and we're gonna get our cassava roti. So let's get right into this recipe guys. So today mom is gonna do this recipe guys because this is not made often and you have to have the touches in doing this right. So mom is gonna be doing this recipe today. So let's so what what force we doing? We grating the cassava right So these are experienced items, you see that? So this cassava roti, the, the most popular thing that they would have this with is fish curry. Okay guys, so our cassava is finished grating and we are ready to move on here. So that was a cup and a half flour to the one cassava. This measurements is easy, right? For baking powder now. That's a tablespoon there, so so I'm gonna try to measure the water here for you guys because a lot of people are asking about the water, the quantity of water used for those which is hard to measure because in different environment you are you're going to use different amounts of water so it's not something we can give you a measurement of but I'll try to do so for this one so we have started with one cup of water here So that looks like it there. Okay, so for the water. Okay guys, so she started with one cup of water and it's a little bit over a half. So she used a little bit less than a half a cup of water. You see that there? So we have our measurement for water here right now. Okay guys, so after you finish kneading, mixing your dough, you want to leave it for about 10 minutes to rest and then continue. So we're going to continue now, this has been resting for about 10 minutes.
Time to make our loy. At least your rotis are usually soft, right? Okay guys, so we have our pan ready and we're gonna try to swell them in here. Improvised. So our pan is hot, so mom is gonna start rolling off here. See how wrong that roti is? So these are made like saddle roti guys. And delicious. Looking good already. So you see it didn't take long on that side. Okay, let's see the swelling here guys. Perfect cassava sada roti. And it's rising, it's rising. See that? Perfect sada roti. And that's as big as it'll get. Perfect swelling, guys. So that's it for sada roti, guys. Cassava sada roti. Okay, guys. So that's it. So let's show you how soft this roti is. Look at that. Look at that. So that's it for our cassava sada roti guys. If you like this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Please share this video also. And as always, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye. Now remember to cook the fish curry to go with it, right?